as I mentioned to one of your you. colleagues, Australia's coming. We're going to continue that conversation on, on how we're going to uh, help. Empty we're still words. washing on Yet the line. Washing I'm one of the lucky on the ones. Line. People are suffering. People are dying. Entire ecosystems are collapsing. We are in the beginning of a mass extinction, and all you can talk about is money and on, fairy on tales gonna, of eternal uh, help. economic growth. I don't growth. want anything to do with anything you? black for at least a week. Washing on the line. This is a superhuman. Escape routes are being swallowed up, and conditions are rapidly deteriorating. We're heading out. Yeah, it's coming this way. All right. Every dog's leaving, not every man. Dad was planning to stay in. This is a superhuman. We're heading out. Yeah, it's coming this way. This is a superhuman. Every dog's leaving. This is a superhuman. Not every man. Dad was planning to stay in. Residents told to flee while they still can. Every dog's leaving. Told to flee while they still can. Not every man. This is this a is superhuman. superhuman. This is a superhuman. This is a superhuman. This is a superhuman. Uh, and what we're going to continue to do, make sure that there is peace, right? Make sure that we, we bring our allies and uh, partners together. That doesn't stop. Uh, but at the same time, right, if Russia's going to invade, invade Ukraine, we have to be there for Ukraine, right? Taking over, trying to take over their sovereignty, uh, their democracy. We have to be there, right? If we have to be there for Israel as they're tr as they fight, fighting off a terrorist organization, right? Innocent people. Are being killed. Look it up on YouTube, and bro. So Look it up right now when y'all done with this video. As I mentioned to one of your colleagues, Australia's coming. Australia. We're going to continue that Please. conversation on, on how we're going to uh, help. We're yeah, still washing me, on the line. Do it. Washing do it. I dare you to. on the line. On, on how we're going to uh, help. Yeah. I don't, I don't want anything to do with anything yeah, well, black before. That we say is going to get clipped. Washing People have already started clipping our interactions over the past few days, so just lean into it. Media companies aren't doing enough to protect us. Australia's coming. Every dog's leaving, not every man. Uh, Australia will rely on Britain. This is a superhuman. Uh, Australia will rely on Britain. This, this, this. Yeah, we have to be there. We it's have to be really there. Really hard to yeah. be this is how, the world. This is how we bring peace to great democracies like Ukraine. Ukraine is a bastion of democracy. Suspend elections. Uh, you know, uh, close down churches, burn leaving. books. They're a bastion of democracy. Day. We need to go there with our peace-loving bombs. That's how this we do it. These warmongering dipshits don't give a... They don't want peace at all, of course. That's the real answer. She should have been more honest. It's to really every war that has started in the past. And then to use our other powers, like our codes and our standards, and what we call periodic notices, to make sure that they're The media could have stopped it if they'd searched deep enough if they hadn't. Um, reprinted government propaganda, they could have stopped it. But what does that mean? Well, that means basically populations don't like wars. And populations have to be fooled into wars. Populations don't willingly and op with open eyes go into a war. So if we have a good media environment, then we'll also have a peaceful environment. I wanted to thank you for your welcome, thank you and your delicious wife for your warm welcome. It's the perfect organization of this trip. Thanks to you and Lucy. Thank you very thank much, you. Mr. Prime Minister. Thank you very much. Thank you. I wanted to thank you. I wanted to thank you. I wanted to thank you. I to thank you. For more than 30 years, the science has been crystal clear. How dare you continue to look away and come here saying that you are doing enough when the politics and solutions needed are still nowhere in sight. You say you hear us and that you understand the urgency. But no matter how sad and angry I am, I do not want to believe that. Because if you really understood the situation and still kept on failing to act, then you would be evil. And that I refuse to believe. He should get in. We want him to get in. It's important that he does get in. They're not going to let him in, so what are we going to do now? We know that France and Russia aren't going to be with us. We're quite confident China's not. 